good day guys i hope you guys are having a nice day in today's tutorial i'd like to be teaching us how to convert your mp3 files to m4a uh, or the wav okay this is very important to musicians and um producers okay and they have actually asked me that what is the best app you could be uh, using to convert uh, your music uh to convert your music into um mp3 okay if you have a wav file you want to compare uh, convert into mp3 uh this is the best app for you and this is the itunes okay previously i made a video on how to download and install the itunes all right now next um i'll be teaching you guys how to be able to uh down uh sorry how to be able to convert files in between mp3 mp uh, m4a and the wav all right so now this is the files that we are talking about all right um this is the music uh file that i want to convert and this music file is on on the is on my desktop right now this music file the name is cool city all right so if i want to import this music into my items how do i go about this i'll just go to file when i go to file uh, i'll go to add to library when i go to like add to library all my files on on the system will actually pop out and this is a cool city that i'm finna looking for all right now click on open now this is a scene city right here all right this is a scene city right here okay now if i want to convert this scene city to and wav first of all i'll go to i'll go to edit when i go to edit i'll go to preferences when i go to preferences um go to import settings when i go to import settings okay uh, mine is already on the the wav but let me change it back to mp3 so most of the times uh the default itunes we come with the mp3 mp uh, encoder all right which is as 160 uh, kilo stops all right now if you want to convert this to to the wav file how do you go about this i'll click on this i'll try then i'll go to wav encoder now going to wav encoder i'll, I'll click on custom now normally the best um, WAV version is um a four um uh four, 44.10 sorry 44.100 kilohertz all right and the sample the best sample rate is what six bytes all right and the best channel to export your WAV is what or is a, is a stereo WAV okay is a stereo channel you click on OK you click on OK you click on OK all right now um most uh the issue that most artists make is um thinking they highlight here no uh you should highlight here okay you should highlight here all right when you highlight here what next uh you go to your file you go to your word you go to convert you go to what create wav version now next you see and two files pop up here now the first one is the mp3 and the second one is the var is the wav version now you just make your itunes small and you don't export in itunes you rather drag it out okay you drag it out now having dragged this out where is it um i think this sh this should be it all right it's cool city cool city but if you check the properties um this one is what uh it's 29 mb and it's a what it's a WAV file, all right? Can you see there? It's a WAV file and it's 29 MB. Now, let's go to check out uh, the MP3. Okay, when you check the MP3, see that this is just 6 MB, all right? And this is an MP3 file, all right? So, uh, this is how to convert your file from MP3 to what? To WAV, all right? So, now, let me delete... Uh, okay, sorry. Uh, this should be the MP3, right? Okay. Okay, that's a WAV file. All right, so let me delete the MP3. When I delete the MP3, I'll go back to my Apple. Alright, when I go back to my Apple, I'll actually export the WAV file into the Apple. You know, drag and drop. Now, this is the WAV file. Okay. Now, I'll go to, when I want to change to MP3, I'll go to files. Okay, sorry, I'll go to edit. When I go to edit, I'll go to preferences. Okay. I'll go to import settings. Now, I'll change it to what? MP3 encoder. Alright. Now everything is changed up, um, 80 kilobytes and stuff like that. Um, stereo wav, right? You go to OK. You go to OK. When you go to OK again, now you actually highlight this. You highlight the wav file. You select it. 
Uh, now, when you select it, you go to File. Okay, you get to, you go to Convert, and what you see there is Create MP3 Version. Now, when you create MP3 Version, and um, this is what we have here. Now you drag it out. Now it's your iTunes telling you well done. All right, when you drag it out, check the properties. And this is the mp3 files, all right? So this is how we convert files between mp3 and WAV in the iTunes, all right? iTunes is just the best app to convert all these things, all right? Um, and basically, I made this video for those that want to be um, distributing their songs through TuneCore, okay? Um, iTunes is just the best thing for you to use, all right? So see you guys in the next tutorial, and bye for now.